The Glee Club is at Westside Hospital recuperating from a collective nervous breakdown. This is the second Glee Club we've lost in two years. We might have to cancel the Christmas pageant. And to think they were this close to regionals. What the hell are regionals? They're this close, Pierce. Anyway, an old friend wants to talk to you. Your favorite Glee Club instructor, the dreamy and boyish Mr. Corey Radisson! Oh. <laughs> uh, I thought I told you to call me Mr. Rad. Or Corey. Just don't call me late to dinner unless you're serving Brussels sprouts. Uh, no. ah, I won't, I promise. <laughs> this guy's like human fro, yo. Look, when the last Glee Club died in that bus crash, you guys stepped up and you were the best gosh darn emergency substitutes I've ever worked with. Oh. Well, this time, I'm not gonna kid you. It won't be easy. Oh. Your best won't be good enough. And 10 times your best will be so bad, I will yell at you. But I promise, if we dig down. Pass. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Don't you hurt him. Mr. Rad! I feel like we let Mr. Rad down. Now he let himself down when he left the house this morning wearing a sweater vest. I guess we did have fun last time. Did we? I can hardly remember. It's all a weird, happy musical fog. Yeah, it was almost like being on ecstasy, only instead of having pointless conversations and dancing like idiots, wait, it was exactly like being on ecstasy. That's what worries me about this guy. He is equal parts Hanson and Manson. Nobody let him corner you until he is out of recruitment mode, or next thing you know, we'll all be caring about Christmas pageants and regionals. Right. Yeah. Deal. Agreed. Gotcha. Hell are regionals. What are you still doing here? I thought I'd give her one more tinkle before I took down decorations. No glee club means no pageant means no Christmas. I'm sure trying to make things brighter just would have made more darkness. That sounds like a certain ex-lawyer talking. I see a lot of myself in you, Abed. You care about your friends, and you wish they cared more about each other. That's not an easy position to be in sometimes. I just want my friends and I to have a Merry Christmas together. Well, maybe you could start by giving them the greatest Christmas gift of all. What's that? Glee, it's a feeling you get when your brain finally lets your heart get in its pants. Glee, it's like a drug that you use that turns pain into shoes and your shoes into dance. How's your piano still playing this song? Glee is the answer when questions are wrong. You'll understand if you just sing along. Cause Glee is the gift that you need. Glee is what I'll spread to my friends like a virus that sends them to a healthier place. Glee, I'll understand every scene because they'll sing what they mean instead of making a face. Families are closer when families are winning. Everything's cooler when cameras are spinning. Singing and dancing in unison in an Glee is the gift that we need. Glee! Thank you, Mr. Rad. Don't break down the set yet. I'm gonna try to get my friends to be in the Christmas pageant. <laughs> Thank you, Abed. Thank you. Uh...